So it, where I work, we often have something called a coffee house once a year in the spring. And um, what if I want the background being primarily this image with the beans and the coffee? And But I, I need my content to go over it. And I know I could kind of squeeze it in up here so everybody can see it, but I don't want that. I need to draw attention to my event. So I might look for elements and type in um, a square. And I can use a rounded rectangle. I can use any one of these, it doesn't matter. And I'm gonna put this on top of it, but that's great because I can type over it, but I can't see the picture underneath. So um, to see the picture underneath, I first am gonna go ahead and change the color. And I'm not totally sold on this color, but let's go with that for right now. Mm, kind of okay. It's this transparency button that I want to drop down. And as soon as you drop it down, you can see the picture behind it. So I need to be able to see it a little bit. Um, so I did bring it back up and now I can go in here and add my text. And I might wanna look for a better font, something from the picture maybe a little bit. But it stands out. I can see I can see the background image. I can see the the content. I can add briefly, I don't want big paragraphs, the location, the time, the date of the event. Um, kind of scannability is the key. I want people to be able to see the coffee house. I want to see the location of it, the time of it. I also don't want to scatter this information. It's not a good technique to um, scatter the information. So I have like a little piece of content there and another piece of content here. It's just, it's not good form. So I might, I want to look at the alignment. We have so many alignment techniques here. And so like you can see all the little pink lines that are coming um, up to make sure that everything's aligned. And I might want to zoom in. Some other things I can do is I want to make sure that they're both right aligned. And then I can see where they are a little bit better. See, now that pink line's coming up and everything is aligned, we have the ability to make sure that things are aligned. Let's use that. So not only do I want to be able to see the picture underneath, but I also want to be able to um, read the content. I want it to be easy. I don't want it to be chaotic. So we're, we're learning some extra techniques in our design to make things look good.